How to share files between two laptops with or without Wi-Fi in Windows 10 or Windows 11. Transfer files from laptop to laptop in eight ways. Hey, I get a new laptop and before giving up the old one, I need to transfer all the files to the new laptop. Is there a way to quickly connect one laptop to another laptop? Can you transfer some data wirelessly? Here, we provided eight easy and efficient solutions for you to transfer files between two laptops in Windows 11, Windows 10, Windows 8, and Windows 7. Follow this video and learn how to share files between two laptops, both with or without Wi-Fi. Solution 1. Transfer files between two laptops using file transfer software, Windows 11 available. Ease us to do PC Trans is the one that you can fully trust and rely on. This software allows you to transfer whatever you want, such as personal files, important software, programs, games, etc., from one PC to another with simple clicks. Follow the steps here to save your time and energy. Step 1. Install and launch Ease Us To Do PC Trans on both two laptops. On the source laptop, select PC to PC to continue. Step 2. Verify the transfer direction. New PC or old PC. Step 3. Then pick options to connect laptops. One is to enter the destination laptop's password account, and the other is to input the verification code. Step 4. Now, choose files to select files for transfer. Choose all the files you need to transfer to another laptop. You can click the edit icon to redirect the selected files to a different location on the target PC by changing the target path. Step 5. After selection, click transfer to start to transfer files from one laptop to another. Except for transferring data from laptop to laptop, Ease Us to Do PC Trans can also copy installed software from PC to PC or transfer everything to a new laptop. Solution 2. Transfer data between two laptops with a shared folder. Windows 11 Windows 10 shared folder is very important for enterprise users who use LAN. In the LAN, users can share data through the shared folders. Let's see how to set up LAN shared files. Step 1. Find the file you want to share. Right-click or press it and select Give access to specific people. Step 2. Select a user or group to add. Click Add. Add the username you want to share. If you are open to all users, you need to add everyone to this user. Adjust the privilege level as needed. Step 3. Click the Share button to enable network discovery and sharing in the dialog. Step 4. Press Win plus R, enter IP address. Then, you'll see all the shares of the IP address. If you don't know your IP address, press Win plus R, type CMD, then input IP protocol configuration. Press Enter and you'll see your IP address. If you select multiple files at once, you can share them all in the same way. It works for folders too. You can also map the shared folder or network drive from File Explorer in Windows without having to look for it or type its network address each time. Step 1. Open File Explorer from the taskbar or the Start menu. Step 2. Select this PC from the left pane. Then, on the Computer tab, select Map Network Drive. Step 3. In the Drive list, select a drive letter. Type the path of the folder or computer, or select Browse to find the folder or computer. Then select Finish. Solution 3. Transfer files using nearby sharing in Windows 10 or Windows 11. Nearby sharing allows you to transfer files and links wirelessly to nearby devices using Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. Step 1. Enable nearby sharing. Enable both of the laptops. Go to Settings System Shared Experiences Nearby Sharing. Turn on it. Step 2. Under Nearby Sharing, select Everyone Nearby. Everyone nearby, your PC will be able to share and receive content from all nearby devices, including those you don't own. My devices only, your PC will share and receive content only with devices using the Microsoft account. By default, transfers will be stored in the Downloads folder, but you can specify another folder or another drive very easily. Under Nearby Sharing, using Save Files I Received to option, click the Change button. Select a location to save transfers. Step 3. Start file sharing between the two laptops. Open File Explorer. Right-click the file you want to share. Click the Share option. Select the device from the list. 
Once you've completed the steps, the user will receive a notification to accept or decline the transfer. The file will be stored in the downloads folder or in the folder location that has been configured in the shared experiences settings page. Solution 4. Transferring data via home group. This method is right for Windows 7 or Windows 8 users. Here, we take Windows 7 as an example. Step 1. On your Windows 7 computer, type home group in the search box and open it. Then, choose Create a Home Group, Next, and follow the instructions. Step 2. Select what you want to share, and click Next. Step 3. Remember the password. Now, go to another Windows 7 or 8 PC, which connects to the same Wi-Fi or network. Open Home Group on it, join in an existing Home Group. Enter the password you got earlier and click Next to join. When you're done, you can open up File Explorer, click the Home Group icon in the navigation pane, and browse anything that's being shared from other PCs in the Home Group. Solution 5. Laptop to Laptop Data Transfer via the Cloud. You can do this by sharing the file to any Windows app that supports services, like OneDrive or Google Drive. Here, we take OneDrive as an example. Step 1. Upload files to OneDrive. Open OneDrive. When the app opens, just click Add to add the file to your OneDrive Cloud account. The file will upload to your OneDrive account. Step 2. Download Wanted Files. On the other laptop, open the OneDrive app, right-click on the file, and select Download. This will complete your file transfer to the other laptop or computer on your network. Solution 6. Transfer files by email. You can email yourself on one laptop and then log into your email account on the other laptop. Step 1. Set the receiver of the email as your own email address. Step 2. Attach files to the email. Different email clients, e, g, gmail, hotmail, yahoo, have different attachment size limitations. So, this method is for small size file transfer. Step 3. Log into your email on the other laptop. Now download the files. Solution 7. Use a USB cable to transfer data. A USB data transfer cable is a great way to move data from one computer to another. It allows you to connect two computers simply through USB ports instead of traditional wireless, Ethernet, or other Internet-based connections. Step 1. Start both computers. Be sure the operating system is running fine on each computer slash laptop. Step 2. Attach the USB cable to a USB port on one laptop. The operating system will recognize the type of cable that has been attached. Attach the USB data transfer cable to the other laptop. Step 3. Click the Windows Start button, type Windows Easy Transfer in the search field and press Enter. Follow the prompts of the Easy Transfer wizard to share files. Solutions 8. Try an external hard drive. If you don't want to be limited by network speed, Windows version number, or transfer capacity, using an external disk is a good choice. Step 1. Connect your external hard drive to one laptop. Step 2. Copy wanted files to the device. Step 3. Eject the drive and connect it to another laptop. Then copy the files to the other laptop. This is it. 8. Simply and easy ways to transfer and share files between laptops. For the easiest way out, you can fully trust and reply on Ease Us to do PC trans. Thank you for watching this video. For more featured videos, please follow and subscribe Ease Us Software YouTube channel.